Are you planning to edit all your video on a tablet? In this video, I'm going to share with you which is the best Samsung S8 you should get for editing in LumaFusion. Let's go! Now, first thing we will talk about is performance. All the tablets, the Samsung models right now, the current models, they can all edit 4K with LumaFusion. Whatever model you choose, this will not be a problem editing 4K. Let that be clear with that straight up first. The Tab S8 has the 4 nanometer chips. Okay, the latest from Samsung is the fastest ever. Okay, so performance wise, you don't have any issues. The minimum RAM is 8 gig, okay, and you can go up to 16 gig. So no problem there with editing 8K on your timeline. The next thing we have to consider is price and what kind of editing needs do you need. And I'm gonna break it down to what kind of user are you. First up, okay, the casual video editor. Basically, this kind of people are just doing a short video now and then, like they have your uh, Instagram Reel, TikTok, uh, now and then YouTube videos, okay, family events, some, something like that, okay. Nothing serious, okay. Just so want to have something pro to simply pro editing software that can they can do editing. Luma Fusion is perfect for that. But which tablet do you need? The base model, the Samsung S. Eight, tab S8 is perfect for that. You just need 128 gig of uh, memory and that's it. And you can always expand it out with a micro SD card and then you can go up to one terabyte. So the great thing about Samsung system is that you can have an external SD, Bravo. micro SD card slot. Okay? So you can expand the memory as you need. The one I have here, the Air, that's it. 64 gig, that's it. That's the minimum. <laughs> okay, so I'm stuck with this, this system, but I edit all my stuff out of sort of, sort of state drive here, Samsung as well. But you don't have that problem. You can always expand your memory. Okay, so as a casual video editor, the base model, that's all you need. Okay. With the memory, 128 gig of memory, you can basically edit from three to five projects easily. Then you have to back up your archive, okay, to somewhere else, some media that is cheap, spinning drive. So if you're gonna do that, you can as well, okay? Or you can upload to the, the cloud, and back up your stuff on the cloud. The next group of people are more like enthusiastic, uh, video editor, uh, YouTuber, and they are just beginner YouTuber, okay? They, they need a semi pro editing app. The kind of people that need this kind of software, okay? Luma Fusion. But they, they just starting out, okay? You guys are starting out, so you don't want to spend too much money. I understand I was that kind of person as well. So I'm gonna recommend you guys to still get a base model SA, okay? Tab SA. Now, the performance is still there, but you don't spend too much money. But I definitely recommend you guys get the 256 gig of memory. Now, with that type of thing, right? You can get five to 10 projects, depending on the length of your timeline, your project. But five to 10 projects to get you started. As I said before, you can always get a micro SD card to expand to the memory to whatever you need. But consider one terabyte of micro SD memory and an external archive as well because you need to back up your project, back up your media. So that's why I recommend get a base model first, learn LumaFusion, then you can start to expand out, okay, further out, okay. But get the base model first and slowly build up the extra gear that you have to become an editor, basically. Now the last group, the pro editor, LumaFusion 2.0. Four doesn't have a scalable UI user interface. So what you need is you need a big monitor, my friend. The 14.6, okay, I round up to 15 inch, okay, okay. The Samsung Tab S8 Ultra is what you need, okay. You need a big screen real estate. So that's what I recommend you guys, okay. You have to max it out, okay. You have to max it out. Start out with the internal drive, the internal memory of 256 gig. 16 gig of RAM, okay, you have to max it out first. And slowly, and slowly, you build up your internal memory to one terabyte. You have to build up your archive memory as well, somewhere else. One thing is to getting a tablet, but you will need media coming in, right? So we have to archive that as well. Get a cheap archive, a spinning drive somewhere, and you're good to go. Now, since you guys are pro, right, you want to go, 
you might want to challenge yourself to add an 8K, 8K as well. So 4K, no problem, 16 gig of memory, but 8K, I haven't tested it out yet, but I think Luma Fusion can edit 8K with this power uh, in, in the tablet, the new tablet. Have you got a clear picture of what Tab SA you should get? I hope you do. I make it clear, very clear for you. So what type of user are you? Choose that model that suits you and your budget as well. If you want to learn Luma Fusion, check this video out right here. I'll see you next time with another video. Bye.